No such thing as bad weather, just inappropriate clothing. Gonna do a little more product testing today with camera. Gonna try out Hyper Smooth uh, Hyperlapse. It's their time lapse thing where it like smooths out the time lapse feature. So we're gonna give that a shot. Quick shout out to my buddy, Handsome Aaron from Houston, Texas, who gave me these shorts. Deep in the heart of Texas. Couple months ago. Love you, buddy. Okay, let's get this thing set up. Three more miles in the books. I got chased by a friendly dog. Helped take the dog back. Hopefully the footage from this looks cool. I'm excited to see it. But then I realized at this point, you've probably already seen it. How does it look? Only one thing to do now, cold shower. A little longer than a few minutes later. Nice. Wait, we gotta get our handshake. Am I okay to record you? Are you good? This is Devin. He's a world-class web developer. He's the man. Yes, very much so. There you go. Another thing I forgot to say about Devin, he's my go-to guy when I need to know what to eat for breakfast and where to eat. This place doesn't look that impressive. Don't let it fool you. I wish, I wish this video was a scratch and sniff. Try not to lick your screens, people. That empty plate is the sign of a good breakfast and a rousing discussion. Did, did that go well? Do you think went that went great. well? Went we get a handshake for the people? Thank you. That was good. Onward, guys. Onward. Good breakfast. Good meeting. You know, I feel like I'm repeating myself saying that these are all good meetings and stuff. And most people don't want to be recorded, and that's fine. I understand that. But I think if we keep doing this thing here, you and me, they will. Because I like sharing what people are doing. Devin is a good guy, and he's a really freaking amazing web developer and designer. And he also has a very funny uh, Twitter account that he runs online that I didn't even know was his for a while. I feel like I keep repeating myself about... Um, I almost ran those people over. Nice to, <laughs> nice to be caught on camera. I feel like I keep repeating myself about all these people that I'm meeting with. Eh, they're a good person, they're a good guy, they're a good guy. But you know what? I say it because it's true. I don't like hanging around crappy people. And I probably won't have uh, any crappy people on here or record them or, or waste time meeting with them. You know, you can, you can be around people that drain your energy and leave you feeling like crap or you can be around people that encourage one another and build each other up and Devin is one of those guys so Devin I love you man keep up the good work thanks for breakfast I can't wait for the next one now we cook up a peanut oil one hour later we get it going. So this is Greg. We went to high school together. What do you What do you do, Greg? I'm a taxidermist. You're a taxidermist. Yes. He has a really awesome Instagram account, <laughs> and uh, is one of the most interesting guys I know. He's home, where we both grew up for Thanksgiving, yep. and we're doing some video stuff. So we're we're doing a video about a bear hunt. Say what you're saying while I look for this fire. All right. So uh, my cousin from New York here came up this fall to Maine, where I live, and uh, we went on a bear hunt and. Uh, we went with a guide that I know, so it was sort of an informal guided hunt, and uh, we got there Friday evening. He wasn't going to be at camp yet, but his girlfriend was there, so he said if we got there early enough Friday, they'd run us right out to the bait and uh, get us on there, so. One day the guy on the buffalo was cruising around through the plain, seen a bear, and he thought to himself, oh man, I gotta get away. Chase him back, guess what? I'm on a buffalo. 
We got there, unloaded our gear, she ran us out, and within an hour, we had the bear on the ground. <laughs> so it was sort of a anticlimactic hunt. We <laughs> were there, and boom, we, we achieved was... what we needed right. to, and we still had three, four days. I was still going to hunt myself, so we had more time in the stand and everything, but we got that bear down, and then uh, we did end up seeing a couple more bear. I didn't connect on one, but um, we did some fishing. to explore a lot of cool territory down. This would be the... Uh, almost the far eastern part of the state along the coast where we're, where we're hunting. And we'll keep, we'll keep all of you posted on how that process goes. So welcome, man. You're my first guest yes. to the studio here. Yes. Welcome. No, welcome. Be cool. <laughs>